Hey guys, it's Bad Dude here. We're back for some more Let's Play Astro Boy Mega Factor. All right, last time, uh, I honestly don't remember what happened last time because it's been a while since I last recorded this. And then, wait, what? Why do my controls? Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, why do my controls work? Oh god! No, screw you. Sweetness. All right, do that. Ooh, great start. Welcome back. Okay. All right. Oh. Ha! <laughs> nice. Okay, you're done. You're done. Okay, boom and boom. Ah. Alright, come back. Boom. Too easy. Ooh, thank you. Got a level right here. Uh, we got a guy in here. I think I want to get him again. I don't know, remember where he is, though. He's somewhere in this elevator. Just don't remember where he is. Okay. And I don't, I don't think there's any point in uh trying to find him again anyway because it doesn't give me another power. He's just I just find him to find him. Okay. Kill these guys. And holy crap that bat almost screwed me. Okay, forget you. There we go. Oh, thank you. Oh, jeez. Goodbye. Thank you very much for your patronage. As a oh god, not this again. Okay, all right. All right, same. It's the same. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 Okay, this should be new commentary because he already knows who Pookie is. You guys must be the Ken Sakaku. This party's over. Alright. Getting Pookie. There's a oh god, not this piece of crap. Ugh. Ugh, I hate this boss so freaking much. Okay, this guy's easy. Oh, get, or not. Oh, screw this guy, dude. It's ridiculous. Oh, I hate that. I use my freaking thing. And then he just freaking transforms. So he can't take the, the benefit of the fall. I want to build up my super. Okay. Holy. Okay. Okay, do that. Watch, you gonna. T yep, knew it. And all this ass wipe. Oh God, I hate you. Ugh. Come at me. Come at me. Or don't come at me. Okay, whatever. Oh, I hate you. This boss was always a freaking pain. As you got as you guys saw in the let's play. Earlier in the le earlier in the let's play, where I had a bunch of troubles with this boss, you guys would know that this boss is absolutely freaking BS sandwiches. And that's a waste. Yep. Well, it's not okay. There we go. 
Uh, I hate this guy. See, like, so bullcrap. You know what? Screw you. Come at me. Come at me. Okay, you're not that bad. All right. Use this chance to build my super. Uh. Okay, don't do that. Oh, jeez. Huh. Okay, keep doing that. There we go. Okay. Use it. Oh, no. Alright, come on. Okay, good, 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 good. That's just what I wanted. I need this, need this chance to build on my super. Okay, come on. Oh, holy crap. I'm not gonna waste my super. There we go. Thank God. That was too close. Whew. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, whatever. Greetings, I am the new International Counselor Drake. Our previous counselor, Duke Red, supported robots, allowing them to do what they want, to go out of control without any kind of retribution. But I shall make things right once again. From this moment, any robot who disobeys an order will be immediately be destroyed. With the strict re robot regulation laws I have laid out, all robots shall soon regret the chaos that I have created. They will behave properly or be destroyed. Drake, that manipulating worm. Using the people's fear of robots to become the international counselor. Are humans afraid of robots? What have we what have we done that's wrong? Oh, don't you worry about it, Astro. There's a plenty of reasonable people like Duke Red in this world. I wonder what Duke Red has been doing recently. Astro, your friend is here to see you. Friend? <laughs> She's really pretty. Great choice, Astro. What? Nuka, what are you doing here? Are you okay? Astro, I came here to say goodbye. I must go someplace very far away. Where are you going? Is Duke Red going with you? I'm afraid I can't tell you. I can't let you get involved in this. But please don't forget that I'll be waiting. I'll be thinking of you even when I'm far, far away. So promise me one thing, Astro, that you'll end this battle between the robots and humans and bring peace. Me? What? How do you know I can do this? I know. Because the Phoenix told me that. You are a very special robot. What? Will you promise me? You bet. Thank you. And goodbye. Wait, Nuka. How did you hear the Phoenix's voice? Astro, there's been an accident at the moon. Oh, not now. And there you have it. Alright. Can I upgrade my jets? Sorry guys, I took a sip of H2O there. And it's this level, remember this guys? Oh gosh. This guy. Your missiles can't harm me. Okay. Doing this. Oh jeez. You know how to do this.
<laughs> bowling pin. Alright, bowling pin. Okay. Okay. Remember the moon's gravity, guys? This was a fun time. Okay, upload the jets. Okay. Use that. Keep doing it. Alright, keep floating. Ugh. Ow. Get that. Huh. Oh, that's bull. Okay, keep doing that. We have to find a way to get up there without these guys being a freaking nuisance. Okay, now go down. Thank you. Jet, jet, jet. Ha! Holy crap, we took him out fast. Ah, more. Ah, that was a waste, whatever. Now this is not a wasteful moment to use it. Because right there, there's a bunch of enemies over here. You know what? Screw you. I didn't mean to do that. Holy lag. We kill these guys so easily now compared to earlier in the game. Are you kidding me? Alright guys, question, when am I going to learn the, the fact that they give you an arm cannon for a reason, why don't you use it when it's most convenient for you? Like right there, I should have used it. I should have used it much earlier than that, but no, I had to keep punching him. Well, then again, I didn't have full health either, so it wasn't really that much of a fair advantage, but who cares? Because I sure don't. Just keep using this. Because they gave you for a reason. See, was that hard? No. And they used the arm cannon the whole time. As an oh gosh, there's no uh, mist in here. Remember that when there was mist in here? Now there isn't because I have my uh, sensors powered up. So there shouldn't be any lag in here, thankfully. Still doesn't make it good. Ugh. Holy slow down. Oh, 
Holy slowdown. Jeez. Like, I can't move. How many enemies? How many enemies are there? There we go. Okay. Keep doing that. Now keep hitting these bats because these bats are super annoying. Because they take forever to kill. Nice. That's what's. That's why it's awesome to have. Just, get down. Thank you. I was worried that I was gonna have the same problem of getting out there. Oh, look at these little guys. Sorry. Holy. Just keep doing this. Once again, they give you it for a reason. Holy! I'm gonna die. Yep, knew it. <sighs> I'm dying from stupid stuff now. Sweet, it's getting ridiculous. <laughs> okay, come on. Just kill these guys so I can move on. This is getting ridiculous. Because I'm coming up and I'm going to miss these guys. Yep. Oh my gosh. Okay. Because I'm coming up on 30 minutes in the recording. Yeah, it took me that long to beat that one area. I know. Embarrassing, right? I guess it's partially because of the Let's Play curse, but I'm not going to blame it on that. Even though it really is the Let's Play Curse, though. There. This girl's probably still here. Oh, never mind. It's a health. But I'll take that. Oh, sorry, I jumped over you there. So we meet again, Astro. I've been waiting for you. Let's see this. Uh, I know what you're thinking, Atlas. Hmm, so you do know. Interesting. Let's see how much you've evolved. Okay, fighting Atlas once again! Okay. Bat start. Okay, once again, the strategy, once he shoots his cannon, get around him, and then use your cannon. Whoa, how did that kill me? See, it's that, it's that. Ugh, that's so dumb. Okay, keep using the arm cannon, best opportunity. Enough Atlas, I have a very important mission I have to accomplish. I fight for a future of peace between humanity and robots, I don't have time to waste with you. 
Ha ha ha, you imagine a dream world, one that will never exist. First of all, that's not what you were built for. Do you want to know what your true purpose in life was for, Astro? You were created as a replacement for Dr. Tenma's late son, Tobio. You're just fake created to help him forget his loss. Okay, sorry guys, <laughs> the back of my chair fell off, so... <laughs> Oh man, but he couldn't truly love a robot as a replacement for a son, so he abandoned you. You're just like me, never truly human nor truly robot, created to help real live a man's anguish, but tossed away, unwanted. I don't believe you. Okay, do that. Ugh. Okay, I gotta finish him now. There, let's go. Hey, there's a robot's head in there along with all the debris. I didn't notice it earlier, but I think I've seen it before. Is this? An artificial hibernation capsule? Atlas, you know this woman, yeah. Okay, read this, we read this, we read, read this, blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Are you Dr. Tenma? That's right, what's it to you? So you must be my father. What kind of robot has a father, you idiot? What? So is what Atlas told me the truth then? Did you really abandon me? Hmm. So what if I did? Do you expect me to get down on my knees and ask you for forgiveness? No. Listen to me, Astro. You are created to overcome the limitations of useless human feelings. Don't let your emotions get in the way. Learn to control and evolve. You have the power. Wait, Doctor. We finally got Atlas. Get more jets. Lord Dead Cross, blah, 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 blah. Dr. Tema is Astro's real father after all, but he has no right to talk to Astro like that. But don't you worry, Astro, I'll be here for you. We got some really big news to tell. Now blah 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 blah. We read this before. Blah 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 blah. Thank you for coming with me. I know we already know this. Had to come. I find out what's It's my mission. How can it me? Oh wait, never mind. <laughs> that wasn't there before. It's because I traveled through time, or was it something else? Humans and robots will find something again if I don't do something. Oh Nuka, what do I have to do to keep your promise? This mystery keeps getting more unclear as I find more clues. Sorry, I didn't know that was really uh a real thing. What's going on and why is Drake here? Hmm, you came, Astro. But we're truly honored to have the president come here to greet us. Huh, so you're Astro. I wanted to see for myself this so-called world's best robot. All I see is a short piece of junk. What? It's okay, Wally. Astro, you were invited for one reason, to bow down and kneel before me. I am tightening my reign on robots with my central focus on the Antarctic. I shall do this by borrowing power from Counselor Drake. That's exactly true. Hmm, it appears Duke Red has snuck off. Who will support you now? You guys are next. Look at this mess these filthy robots are making. Ha ha, everything is proceeding as planned. I'll take out robots with this. This situation is getting ugly, Astro. You've got to stop them right away. And we will do that in the next episode, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Astro Boy and Mega Factor. And I'll see you guys next time.